Hey everybody, welcome back to Splitting Image Taxidermy. Thanks for joining us. Today we're going to discuss the pros and cons of air freight versus ocean freight. Traditionally, ocean freight has always been seen as the more economic version of shipping your taxidermy back to the United States. Today, we're finding that the costs between air freight and ocean freight are fairly similar. So given the choice, we would naturally err on the side of air freight. Please keep in mind, dip and pack shipments cannot go by ocean freight because there's a percentage of salt in the skins. The salt draws the moisture, and if we were to send by ocean freight, by the time they get to the final destination, they'd probably be moldy and the hair would start to fall out. We really don't want that. So the dip and pack shipments would have to go by air freight. Taxidermy is processed and is more resilient and therefore can go by ocean freight. So if you have a large consignment and we're able to fill a container, this is a good option and we do sometimes get tremendous rates. Air freight nowadays is a competitive industry. We're here to make sure that we get the best possible rates on the export of your trophies, either by sea or by air freight. Please take the time to visit our website, www.splittingimagetaxidermy.co.za. There's lots of great information on the site, and I'm sure once you've gone through it, it will highlight all the good that we can do for you for your next taxidermy experience. Thanks very much.